high brand tech here where tech is made simple. So we have our latest WSA Windows subsystem for Android update rolling out for the month of March 2023, which has now been bumped up to version 2302. So it was on 2301, now on version 2302, and um, is available now for the dev and beta channel insiders for testing. And um, although it doesn't contain any new features, um, it does include some important um, improvements for stability, graphics, security, and audio improvements. Now, a brief background on um, WSA Windows Subsystem for Android, um, in case you're unaware, is that WSA basically lets you um, run Android apps on Windows 11, as many of you would know, which is currently still in um, preview, so it's still in the Insider program, hasn't been rolled out yet. Uh, to the stable version of Windows 11 and um, that means that you can download and install apps and games directly directly from the Amazon App Store if you have um, WSA uh, installed on your device meaning you can run Android apps then um, on your Windows 11 operating system. Now if we just head over to GitHub where the latest release notes uh, for the version upgrade to 2302 um, have been uh, made available um, as mentioned, um, in update to improve stability, audio issues, and security. So if you are following um, WSA or are using it uh, in the Insider program, just to let you know what's new. So there are stability improvements to graphics card selection. Um, there's also updates to the WSA settings app to include performance options for graphics cards, which I think is a nice move. Um, Docking and undocking with external monitors issues fixed with the subsystem. So that's a bug fix. Another fix um, or fixes in this case, uh, fixes to apps with audio buffer issues. And then because, um, as I have posted previously, WSA has been upgraded to Android 13 a while back. And we get now all these security updates, which is also a nice move in the right direction for Android 13. And... Uh, um, in case you are unaware, um, if you want to try out WSA and you are in the Insider program, you can download um, the latest Windows subsystem for Android from the Microsoft Store. And I'll leave a link uh, to uh, this webpage um, in the Microsoft Store down below if you'd like to try it out. And as I have mentioned previously, unfortunately at this stage, although Microsoft is pushing um, WSA out to more regions, um, I have not yet received um, Windows Subsystem for Android with the Amazon App Store in my region as yet. But nonetheless, just want to keep you updated and posted in case you are following what Microsoft is doing and um, improving with the WSA. And then obviously in the future that will be rolling out to the stable version. Although um, at this stage not confirmed by Microsoft when that will be taking place, but because it is in the beta channel, it is getting closer to a possible stable release, even possibly sometime later this year. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.